Thank you guys! Yeah. Hello guys, good morning! Yeah, I'm glad to meet you again and I have a very surprise vlog for you. Oh, uh, by the way, it's not vlog, it's vlog for short. Yeah. I just uh, met my mentor and then he just corrected me. It's not vlog but vlog for vlog vlog. It's a very very special guest for you. It's uh, one of the 10 star diamond of Yusana. And I knew you, you knew this guy and his name is Billy De La Fuente. Okay. Billy and Josephine De La Fuente are the 10 star diamond of Yusana. It's what today we're going to have a one-on-one -on -one question and answer with him about Yusana. The first question is goes like this. What was the first thing you did when you started Yusana? 10 years ago, the very first thing that I did was to learn the business, to study the ropes. Because in anything you do, for the very first time, of course, when I was starting, I have, you know, no idea. I started studying, learn. And instead of like doing the business without attending trainings or studying or researching, it's going to be more difficult. But since I studied first and then it speeds up the process so that I can start earning faster. After that, I started applying what I've learned and then I started to form my own team. Since I already know something, the basics, I started teaching those basics to my new distributors. And with that, team grow exponentially. Two is, during your downtime moments in USANA, what did you do to lift up your momentum? Every time that I feel down or let's say a bit uh, low energy, it's either I use my power board, you know. Power board is like all of my goals and dreams posted in one print. For example, my dream house, my dream car, my dream travel. Every time I feel low bad, I check my power board and then I get recharged. A lot of times, I talk to other associates, other leaders, that can inspire me. Most of the time, I talk to my wife, to Mentor Pin. She is my inspiration, so she gives me more energy. And sometimes when I feel low, okay, she lifts up my spirit. Uh, a rest of one or two days, and then the next day, I'm back at it again, trying to uh, build momentum again. I'm more energized, more powered. You know, you get inspiration. To other people as well but most of the time motivation should shouldn't be external it should be internal since I'm well motivated enough sometimes I low but I just need a little bit to fresh and then the next thing you know BAM I'm at it again working at it again number three did you encounter financial difficulty or challenges during your early USANA years when I started doing the business of course we were not yet stable problem with uh, you know managing finance and once you, you just got married, of course, your income is zero, zero, right? So I think everybody who starts their business, especially while they're young, they have financial difficulties or problems. But the strategy there is instead of focusing on the problem, you need to focus on the solution. Because if you focus on the problem, of course, anything you focus, it grows. If you focus on the problem, then the, prob the problem grows. But if you focus on the solution, then you will find the solution for the problem. So for me, instead of dwelling on the problem of having financial difficulties, I don't look at that. I didn't focus on that. Instead, I focus on growing my business so that uh, my business can be the solution for my problem. Okay. One more question came from one of our associates here. How long is the commitment required in USANA to win and how to deal with it. I think when you commit to something, it's forever, right? Like marriage, you don't have a time limit for it. For me, um, if it takes 20 or 50 years until I hit that target, no, I, I suggest you wouldn't stop. Because if you only commit like a year or two years, what if you, you didn't give your 100%? So it would take longer, right? I think the proper question would be what's the right mindset the effort that you need to give in doing the business then I would suggest is for you to be all-in you have to have the all-in mindset that you need to give your hundred percent 
so that you can get 100% income in the business as well. Okay guys, so inviting each and every one of you, if you want to be successful in business or in life, I'm inviting everyone to subscribe to www.waitleydelafuente.com Why? This is the best online training, the most affordable training, the most amazing training with no other than Dr. Dennis Waitley. He's an amazing guy. If you don't know him, for sure you're a millennial. And if you want to be successful right now, in your earlier years, learn from all of his wisdom. He has trained astronauts, Olympic athletes, gold medal athletes with a lot of motivational speakers, John Maxwell, um, <clears throat> Zig Ziglar, Mr. Tracy, you know, a lot of them. He is actually my mentor right now and I've learned a lot from him. That's why growth in my business is actually from him because the learnings that I've I've got from him, I applied in my business. That's why my business grow and my family is okay. The, th the teachings that he shares to us, it's really amazing. So, if you want to accelerate your business, your life, be more happy and content and you know, in a holistic point of view of success, go to www.waitleadelafuente.com And with that, thank you guys! Don't forget to subscribe to Ying Newton, starting vlogger, and for sure, I wish and pray that you become successful too in vlogging and also in business. Bye! So right guys, that's all the question and answer from our 10 star diamond, Billy James De La Fuente. I hope you have learned something and learned a lot. We're gonna make a lot of vlog and there will be more short upcoming vlog this coming years. Thank you for tuning in and spending your time watching my vlog and you subscribe and comment below. Thank you! Like they create knives, so they they gave me something. But this also is extra special. Yes, yeah. this one also.